science. In this video, I'd like to find the uh, LCM and the GCF of 20 and 30, the lowest or at least common multiple or the greatest common factor of 20 and 30. So I like to use a factor tree, so let's get started. Let's complete a factor tree for 20. I will begin with 2 times 10, circle the 2 because it is prime, and now 2 times 5 equals 10, circle both of them because they are prime. And I'm now down to prime numbers. So I will write the prime numbers for 20 are 2, 2, and 5. Now let's complete a factor tree for 30. We have 2 times 15, circle the 2 because it is prime. Now 3 times 5 equals 15, circle the 3 and the 5 because they are prime. So the prime numbers, and we're down to prime numbers, so the prime numbers for 30 are 2, 3, and 5. Now for the least common multiple, basically we just multiply all the prime numbers together, except if you have the a duplicate prime number in both the 20 and the 30, you only multiply it once. So let's begin. So we have 2, we have a 2 in both 20 and 30, so we multiply 2 times 2 times 3 times 5, and it's a duplicate, so we will only use it once. So now 2 times 2 times 3 times 5 is 60. So the smallest number that both 20 and 30 will multiply into, or the LCM, is 60. So now let's find the GCF. And I'm going to rewrite uh, 20 and 30 in their prime numbers so it's not confusing. Okay, and now for that, uh, the greatest common factor is the largest number that will divide into both of these equally. And so you must find a number that is in both a prime number that is in both of these numbers. And so we have 2 because notice it's in both numbers. This 2 is not. This 3 is not in both numbers. And the 5 is in both numbers. So 2 times 5 is 10. So that would be your GCF or the greatest common factor. So there we go. The LCM which is 60 and the GCF which is 10 of the numbers 20 and 30. Thanks for watching and Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.